Good afternoon. So I saw this question on the GDevelop forums. How is it possible to make a sprite animation run for a specific number of loops rather than looping forever? Um, now this isn't built in functionality, but it's quite easy to do. Um, as always, you'll find the scenes in the uh, description of the video. And uh, yeah, as always, please keep giving your suggestions. Uh, without further ado, here we go. So this is the um, tutorial scene. So we have our player character, um, who doesn't actually do much, but every time I press Q and reload the scene, you'll notice the animation only plays once. Um, what I can do then, to demonstrate that I can make it play any number of times, um, you'll see I've created a behavior called animation looper. I will change this number. Uh, yeah, let's change it to two. Um, now when I press play, you'll see that instead of only running once, once, twice, and then it stops. So this is the behavior as expected. Let's get into how it works. Um, there's actually no events in this scene, um, just one so that when I press Q, it automatically re it just reloads. Um, actually, all the good stuff happens in a behavior called animation looper. So under animation looper, you'll see there's one um, pre-event step, and pre-event step uh, just runs every frame, it just runs all the time. And all it does is this. It checks if whatever object it's attached to, and the object it's attached to has to be, if I go under behavior properties, it has to be attached to a sprite, so we know it can have an animation. Um, and I should also point out there are two variables. One is called number of loops. This is visible in the editor. That was the number I was changing. And then there's an internal one called loop count. This is hidden. Um, and we use this to work out when we want to stop looping. So we say if the animation of our sprite is finished and the loop count, so the number of times we've looped is less than the number of times we want to loop, change the animation back to frame zero and then add one. And so that allows us to keep adding one and keep replaying it until we hit our number and then we stop. And so that's how it works. So if I change it to three and press play, animation by default play once, twice, and then three times. And just as easily, you can change it back to one and then it will only play once. There we go. Hope this has been of use. Please like and give thoughts and feedback and I'll see you at the next one.